So today we're out on Lake Seminole following a message we got via the Facebook page from George Lasseter. Hello, kind of new to the game. What location did you catch? Foxtrot, uh, any other hotspots on Seminole Lake? So I thought we'd jump out and do exactly that for George and anyone else wondering where indeed we caught Foxtrot. So as you can see, we head right out of the um, boat dock and then we hang a left and we just go up north hugging this um, left hand part of the venue and then when you see the option to turn right there if you look over to your left and kind of on this corner where these trees are and this kind of mossy section that covers the water this is exactly where we caught a uh, foxtrot just a few days ago that i posted in the uh, the dovetail discord um, I don't really go out looking for legendaries, I just go out and fish, just put the trolling motor on, throw, throw out a few different baits and see indeed um, what we can catch. Um, so just starting out throwing some spoons and a couple of topwater frogs in this section. I think it was on the, uh, is it the 5 inch Ben Parker spoon? I think it was that I caught Foxtrot on, um, which is a bit surprising because you normally catch them on the larger 8 inch. Uh, but you can see in this area definitely some activity as we get straight into some action with a large mouth here showing you indeed that there are some good fish in this area not as abundant as say lake chica but definitely some massive massive fish you can catch out on lake seminole there's some very very good spots as we do catch with a trophy fish there uh, our first fish of the session. Uh, a little bit after that, back in and once more. And a nice hook up. Smoking that one just after the drop. We get another fine bass in this session here. A very good seven pound nine ounce. Lake Seminole, very strange in that. You get a lot of sort of like seven, so six, seven, eight, nine pound largemouth bass classed as a trophy fish, but uh, you get some of the bigger ones like the 13, 14, 15 pounders, and, and they're not even trophy level. So something a little bit amiss there, something a little bit strange on Lake Seminole, but just good here to get out and uh, just chuck some laws and see what we can find. We do end up Boating, another white bass, a nice trophy there. And with some cast out to the right side here as well, again, sort of over these mossy covered areas, just looking for some of these largemouth that are hanging around underneath cover. I think the weather in this session was about 70 degrees. We land. Another nice little four pound largemouth there. Again, not exactly monsters in this video, but just showing in the area that I was fishing and some of the fish um, that I caught on today's session. Another nice little hook up there. Bass just busting through that cover. Taking our lure, absolutely smoking it. We get to land. Another catch there. The spotted bass. Another trophy this far this time. A three pounder. Breaking out the frog and just uh, just chucking it into the uh, the long grass there. As well, seeing what we can perhaps entice to jump out and take our lure. this bad boy in come on get in the boat you know you want to yes get yes. in there and a very nice chunky six pound largemouth right there surprised he doesn't make trophy 
it's a good size. Again, just love chucking this top water uh, pad crasher frog. Getting another nice hook up here. But yeah, I definitely want to do some more spots from Seminole and the other venues as well. Doing some uh, hunting big bass videos and really show you some of the big, the big boys. But we get hooked up again here with a topwater frog with a nice striper, which will probably be the last one to show you in this uh, hot spot. But do give this spot a try. There's some really, really amazing spots around Seminole, as I said. So uh, just get out there, guys, and practice and uh, just have some fun. But well, I hope this venue, uh, or this spot I should say, helps you and uh, hopefully you can catch uh, Foxtrot as well. Or perhaps one of the other legendaries uh, in this area. Let me know how you get on. Uh, but that's it guys. Thanks for watching. I hope this helps. Um, and uh, look forward to seeing you, seeing some of you in the online open at Toledo Bend. And uh, until the next one, thanks for riding along.